Bravo. Good Samaritan. Good Samaritan. Teamwork helps everybody. Yeah. yeah, Good Samaritan. Thanks for watching CBS 19 News at 5. The News at 6 with Dan and Tara starts right now. Live from the CBS 19 News studio, this is CBS 19 News at 6. Charlottesville News first. The Virginia House voting on a bill that would lead the way to clean up coal ash ponds, including the site in Fluvanna County. New information about a shooting incident in Nelson County that had police asking people to stay inside last night. And the UVA men's basketball team with another ACC test this weekend. Notre Dame coming to the John Paul Jones Arena. We'll have a preview for you. Good evening, everyone. I'm Dan Shooting. And I'm Tara Wheeler. Thank you for joining us. New information about a shooting in Nelson County last night that had people staying inside their homes while police searched for a suspect. That suspect now identified as 47-year-old James Saunderson. He was found dead inside his home on Rhodes Valley Drive this morning. Earlier in the night, police say Saunderson was in an argument with a 45-year-old woman and fired several shots at her. She was able to escape and drive to a Wintergreen fire station. Police set up a perimeter, and about 7 in the morning, a SWAT team entered the home. That's when officers found Saunderson dead from a gunshot wound. The victim expected to recover from her injuries. This afternoon, the Virginia House of Delegates voted on legislation that aims to improve the quality of Virginia's waterways, including local sites. CBS 19's Darnell Myrick with more on today's vote. Darnell. This afternoon, the Virginia House of Delegates overwhelmingly passed the bill that will require Dominion to remove all coal ash ponds in the Chesapeake Bay watershed, including the one in Fluvanna County. The bill passed 97 to 2. Dominion will either have to recycle the coal ash or move it to a modern line landfill. 